Hi everyone, Muriel here with a project share. I wanted to come on and show you two projects that I finished uh, just using some items that I had in my stash and um, something that I picked up yesterday that someone was going to discard. So I came in my craft room last night and thought what could I do with this and I was inspired by At Home with Zane. If you're watching Zane, I made this picture frame with uh, inspiration from your channel. Zane had gone to a thrift store, as he does quite often, and purchased a picture frame. Of course, it was a different type of picture frame, but he used the word joy. It was a picture frame that was divided in three sections, three different pictures. And he used um, some uh, maybe burlap letters and he created a beautiful sign for his home um, that says joy. So when I saw this picture frame with the beveled um, insert, which is really pretty, I thought I needed to do something to it and gift it to a friend. <clears throat> this is something that you can just put on the wall in your home, maybe as soon as someone walks in, if you have a foyer area, or you know that kind of small space in your kitchen, so I pulled out some paper. This is paper from the Cozy Lodge, which I am in love with, as you know. It is a green, um, and you can kind of feel the snowflakes on it. And then I uh, spelled the word joy with these letters that I recently had purchased from Tuesday morning. They are Yuletide by Pink Paisley, so they are a bunch of uh, white letters, and you recall I also bought the red ones, but the red ones were numbers. So they're probably about two inches, two and a half inches long. And then I'm using some of these beautiful poinsettias that was gifted to me um, by Arlene. If you recall, Arlene had a bombdiddy.com scrapbook room sale this summer and um, I just bought a lot of things and um, one of which were flowers. Of course she had gifted me this. You can see the little notes put on the back. But these beautiful poinsettias by I Am Roses. So I just did that. Um, the only reason why I put this holly there is because there was a speck of red and I don't know where it came from but I couldn't get it off so I didn't want it to remain that way so I just put a small little holly and this is just from a recollection sticker pack looks like that Christmas Noel it has some um, ornaments and a couple of little hollies so that completes the picture frame I thought it was really really cute I'm sure she will love it like I said it's very small enough, maybe she can put it on her foyer table. Um, like I said, I got this, um, it was gonna be a throwaway, so I noticed on the back that it doesn't have the hooks, but you can always purchase those, and I will do that and just tape it on the back so um, she can choose to use this however she wants. So then my other project I made, um, you saw some of it last night, I was gifted a beautiful ornament from Alicia. Alicia uh, did a swap with me of a gift bag and she gifted me a beautiful, um, it's kind of in the middle of this, um, a beautiful ornament. It was on acrylic and it had the bird with the pine cones and the sprays. So what I did was I had a couple of sprays laying around and when I say sprays, um, picks like this that I picked up from Michaels. I basically pulled off that part, the spray part, and I just um, tucked them in to make this a little bit fuller. I tucked them in all over. And then I also picked up two uh, picks with the alligator clip from the Dollar Tree. One is here with the gifts. The other one is here with these pine cones and I clipped them on. And I have it secured with foil, uh, foil, with floral wire. Okay, I'm using this to secure it on the back. And then I took the word Christmas, and you recall this, it is from Michael's Dollar Spot. I had Christmas and I had the word believe, and they're already uh, a texture, like a grow grain fabric on it in this chipboard. So again, I secured it on here with the floral wire 
and where the wire are I covered it with two more of the beautiful white poinsettias that was gifted to me by Arlene so this uh, frame which is a white um, snowflake I purchased this at Michael's I don't know how many years ago you can go back in my playlist and see but it was regularly a 1999 object and I got it from the clearance for five dollars basically whatever was on the center of it had fallen off so they just had this on the sales rack and I thought I'm going to use that somehow so I made this beautiful if you want to call it a snowflake reef and um, I don't know if I'll be gifting this I may just keep this for myself maybe to switch up um, I'm just not sure but it has the um, hole right here where I could put the ribbon through and hang it on the door so those are my two projects that I'm working on that I finished which I'm so happy about and um, I am you know I've talked about the ugly sweater and I'm definitely going to make it but I need to go do uh, be a beautician right now and you know we need to do hair as we do here on Sunday afternoon so I thank you for watching Alicia thank you so much I'm so glad you gifted me that snowflake ornament I knew what I was going to do with it and um, Arlene thank you for these beautiful flowers that you gifted me for definitely for Christmas projects they came in handy when making this beautiful joy sign that I'm going to be gifting to a friend so thanks for watching everyone have a wonderful day bye now